bustling. For Albuquerque, it's going to be a little later in the day for all this to happen. Okay. The mountains will obviously see the storms first, and then once that gets going, everything's going to start to get going this afternoon and evening. And it's going to be scattered too, so maybe you'll be so in a spot that doesn't get as the rain. Possible. So we'll keep a close okay. eye on things, but wherever gets the rain, it's going to get it in a very heavy way. And it is going to be more widespread than it has been for the past couple of days, that's for sure. Flash flood watches are in effect from 11 a.m. until 11 p.m. for all of these areas highlighted in green. That goes for Albuquerque, Berlin, so the Rio Grande Valley, up to Raton, Farmington, Gallup, down to Silver City and the Gila. And uh, we're going to be looking at rain rates perhaps up near two inches an hour. And it's not going to be the case of a very slow moving storms. The storms will be fairly slow. It's going to be more the case of storms redeveloping after storms pass on through that could just bring in more rain and continue to bring it in. That's going to be the kind of pattern that we're going to be getting in today. So we're going to keep a close eye on things. We're going to see it ramp up uh, really from south to north. Southeast New Mexico will be one of the quieter spots, but even you will have the potential to see a few storms today. As far as right now goes, again, a gorgeous start to this Wednesday morning. It's a little cloudy in spots, but we should start to see these move out and clear out a little bit through the next few hours before we start to get uh, more clouds developing to bring in the rain later. 76 degrees, so comfortable out, not too muggy yet, but we will get more moisture moving into Albuquerque, so it'll feel a little muggier later on today. Right now, no rain to really talk about. A few sprinkles over in the Gila, and that's about it for us right now. We're going to see a lot more action uh, later on this afternoon, and the weather pattern is going to stay very active today and tomorrow. It quiets down, quiets down a little bit for Friday and Saturday, but we're going to see it ramp back up again Sunday, and even with the quieter pattern Friday and Saturday, it's not going to be as quiet as it has been in the past two days. We're still going to see some activity. So monsoon season in full swing. We also have a disturbance that's going to be pushing through. We'll have a couple of them. One will move through today. This one will be a little weaker. and uh, That could ramp up the winds so though. Late morning into the afternoon, we're going to have those winds that get squeezed through the canyon. And once that happens, that's when they really pick up that speed. And so it could be breezy to a little windy at times this afternoon for Albuquerque. We're going to see basically the same thing tomorrow too. So we're going to be looking at breezy to windy conditions from the east for the metro area through the canyon. That's where we'll have to watch for the stronger winds, 40 mile an hour winds there, and then 30 to 35 mile an hour winds for the rest of the metro area. So again, a little breezy to windy at times, a lot of moisture to work with, an active day. Southeast New Mexico, the one spot that will probably see quieter weather for us this afternoon. But tomorrow, uh, we're going to be looking at that moisture trying to push to the east here. So we're going to see better chances for some rain there too. So as a whole, rain chances definitely going up for much of the state today and tomorrow. And there's going to be that potential for some very heavy rains in some of those storms. And as we go into the weekend, we're going to continue with those daily rounds of afternoon showers and storms as well. Here's a look at your forecast for southern Colorado. Partly cloudy, scattered thunderstorms this afternoon. 86 in Durango, more active weather tomorrow. And we'll continue with those afternoon storm chances into the weekend. Northwest New Mexico, a cloud cover out right now. We'll continue to see that thicken up. And we'll see temperatures topping out in the low to mid-90s with Thunderstorms around today and tomorrow, and even a few stray storms in the forecast each afternoon going into the weekend. For the southwest, uh, we'll see very heavy rain here, widespread. And again, flooding the big concern as we go into the weekend. The weather stays active even into early next week. Southeast New Mexico, a few stray storms are possible today. Sacramento Mountains looking better for the rain. And then we'll continue with storm chances over the next few days. Looking a little better for Roswell tomorrow. Northeast New Mexico, partly cloudy with scattered storms this afternoon. And more active weather to come. Northern Mountains, uh, scattered storms this afternoon too. Santa Fe looking at decent chances to pick up some rain today and tomorrow in a big way. East Mountains, upper 80s with scattered thunder storms and your forecast for the metro uh, will top out in the low to mid 90s today and we'll definitely see a better chance for storms this afternoon and tomorrow afternoon and then it quiets down a little bit Friday Saturday goes back up again Sunday Monday it cools off over the next few days but uh, we're going to be in a very active pattern into the weekend so get ready for it all right thank you for the update Kristen